My name is Joseph S. K. Pambu Jr., Manager and CEO of the Wireless Technology Lab. Wireless Technology Lab is a computer awareness and digital literacy training center located in rural Liberia. One of the major challenges of university students in Liberia is the transportation. Because of the lack of on-campus residential for students, students have to travel in long distance traffic and which results sometimes in high cost of transportation because of the traffic and other. I'm developing an e-learning portal for the University of Liberia to have connection with its students' population so that they can have access to their learning process through the internet. And with this, we can have huge productivity. Why made will be designed for University of Liberia to have its student organizations get connected to their organization's platform and also the University of Liberia to have connection between the students and the university because in the University of Liberia there are different groups on campuses that are trying to find way to collaborate and share information so that they can be part of the learning process if this organizations and groups that are formed on campuses can have access to information and share them wherever the members are then the university will have a platform to encourage students to perform better instead of them poorly performing in terms of participating in the learning process because most time because of the challenges involved the 35,000 students don't even make it to university classes because the training process is still in the old school method where you have to meet the lecturer, you have to like sign in or you have to like deliver your assignment. So sometimes you find students queue in lines trying to like check if their assignments have been delivered instead of just having a portal where they can like transfer all the assignments and they can be in their chat groups where they are located and do their assignment and solve it and send it through this platform that's why the wireless information management to advance digital education will be designed to help the students and the university to collaborate and make the learning environment to be interactive because in liberia we have 80 percent rate of mobile penetration with 5.3 percent of internet so there is more need to be developed in terms of connecting access. So with the infrastructure and development going on in Liberia, university student union are demanding for an administrative complex. I was introduced to computer in 1999 by my uncle and since then my passion for becoming a computer scientist has always been there. After the completion of my secondary school, I had the opportunity to go and study engineering at Frobe College University of Sierra Leone, but I later migrated and that made me to drop out because of the distance. I later further my university education at the Amity University Pan-African E-Network program at the University of Liberia and get a diploma in IT. Later, I saw a constraint of young people trying to have access to media. YME was designed with the idea of streaming data over Wi-Fi. So we created it with the idea of people having access to their mobile phone and that one content can log on to the YME Wi-Fi and log on to the YME server and entertain themselves with educative materials. The idea of why may started with the concept of streaming media over wireless. So what we did, we did some few research and came across some few applications and decided to use Media House. What we did, we configured a, wife, a, a wireless router and we made it a, the why may wireless access point. So when connected to that access point, we have our computers that serve as servers and we instruct them to stream media so we use our smartphones and we go through the media house and get connected to those contents that are on the computer 
so what first we did we try to put contents that are really meaningful content that people would like to see so we have some of this content such as entrepreneurship training content we have content for entertainment and these contents were there to help people to make use of their devices because in Liberia we have 80% penetration of mobile phone but a percentage of 5.3% use the internet so meaning that there's most devices that are not connected to the internet but need contents so when you put your Wi-Fi off your wireless the media you don't have access to it so in doing so we decided and told it fit that we have to do something with this 80 percent mobile phone penetration that sees only 5.3 percent penetration of internet so why made was designed principally to get people connected to contents contents that will enhance their learning ability contents that will entertain them so with the media house and the connection to our wireless you have access to our content but without the connection to our wireless you can't access our content so connecting to our wireless is the point where you have to come to us and then we will give you the access to use the wireless but nevertheless when connected to our wireless you will be exposed to tons of media through the media house that we were using so we have tested it we have seen the work we have prototyped it with people now we want to produce our own media house where we will incorporate some features features like using your mobile money to pay for maybe subscription fees to pay for other things that maybe you will want to pay for because we are going to design a platform where people can have access to contents that they really need so we have different categories of users <laughs> Yeah. 